On April 18th, Robert Wood Johnson, University Hospital Hamilton President and CEO Anthony Skip Semino was awarded Citizen of the Year by the Mercer Regional Chamber of Commerce. We sat down with Semino to discuss the award and what it meant to be part of the Hamilton community. I was named Citizen of the Year from uh, Sherry Ritter, uh, who was uh, the uh, chairman of the board at the time when the call came in. And uh, she called me and she uh, explained to me that uh, the chamber uh, committee as well as the board of directors had uh, voted uh, for me to be the Citizen of the Year and would I accept. Uh, there was a pause on my end, quite frankly, because I was significantly surprised. When you look at the uh, past award recipients over the 36-year history of the award, uh, there are not only great New Jerseyans, but also great Mercer Countyans. Well, I, I mean, it's, it's a, a tremendous uh, opportunity to watch your children grow and for them to achieve. Uh, Nikki, Noel, John, and Janine uh, have all been uh, just uh, wonderful children and a uh, source of great pride. Um, AJ, Emma, uh, Justin, and Jordan, and of course, I think any grandparent would tell you that they're the, the most beautiful children on the face of the earth. One of the very nice things that happened to me recently was uh, the opportunity to uh, stand and swear in my son for another term as a Mercer County freeholder. Uh, clearly, and to watch him take the seat that I held 20 some years ago, uh, clearly that was a great proud moment for a father. I learned uh, the principles and concepts of a small business. So how do you make a payroll? How do you have a budget? How do you ensure customer service uh, to, uh, to people? How do you communicate and ensure that everyone understands? And in a small business, and clearly managing a $220 million organization, you need to understand budgets. You need to make sure that uh, every two weeks that the money is there for payroll, uh, and fortunately it is. Uh, but those concepts uh, are concepts that I learned as a very young man, and they have uh, held me in good stead, whether it's been here at the hospital or actually even at the engineering company. I've had the good fortune to uh, be elected by the people of the local municipality in Hamilton Township, as well as to have been elected freeholder, uh, as well as to have been elected assemblyman. Uh, those are uh, gifts that are given to you by the people uh, and uh, allowing you to do uh, the kinds of good things that you think should happen. And then finally, uh, I had great confidence placed in me by Governor Florio to become a member of his cabinet. So. Uh, when I look across the span of uh, time in my life, uh, those were uh, just exceptional things uh, that uh, candidly don't come to each and every individual in our society, uh, and I hold those moments uh, very dear. never foresaw uh, that I would someday be the president and the CEO. I felt a great burden. Uh, to have that level of confidence and trust placed in me uh, to ensure that the hospital continue to function. At the end of the day, the hospital is the largest community asset for this community, and so the stewardship of, uh, of the institution uh, is uh, inherently important to me to ensure that we're delivering the appropriate care to all of the residents. Uh, last November, we opened up uh, just an exceptional uh, uh, opportunity for ourselves with the new pediatrics emergency department. That unit uh, has a s uh, specific pediatric nurses, uh, pediatricians are there, more so than just emergency room doctors. Tra taking care of a child is different than taking care of an adult. The other uh, great opportunity for us has been the linkage now with the Jefferson Neurosciences Network. It avails us of the, uh, the great wisdom of the Jefferson uh, Neurosciences Network. And I also thought as we were developing the relationship that um, we were given the opportunity to take a nationally recognized brand in Robert Wood Johnson and a nationally recognized brand in Jefferson and combine that, which would help us deliver the best quality that we could to the region. Uh, really a sense of purpose and a sense of mission. Um, I remember uh, years back um, that it was important uh, to me to 
make sure that I was committed to my community. I think by virtue of the things I've been able to accomplish uh, with the help of many, because you don't get here without the help of many, uh, quite frankly have given me a very, very uh, uh, rich life.